When you want to transcribe data, you first need to add to the project the audio or video file that you want to transcribe. Here we add a recording of an interview. The next step is to import an empty text file that you have prepared beforehand, for example in Word. The text file is now associated with the audio file. Before you begin to type, add a timestamp at the beginning of the document by clicking on Edit Timestamp. Next, click on Add Timestamp. Listen to the recording by clicking on the Play button. Qualitative data analysis is like exploring a data landscape. Type what you heard in the text document. Then, click on Add Timestamp again. Listen to the next section of the interview. Instead of clicking the play button, you can also press the space bar to start the audio file. This is a statement and you'd like to use these pictures in your workshops and your excellent books. Type what you heard. Add a timestamp by clicking on the add timestamp button. If you want to review what you have just typed, double-click on the respective entry in the list of timestamps. This is a statement and you'd like to use these pictures in your workshops and your excellent books. Everything is correct, so let's continue to play to the next segment. Can you tell us something about the evolution of this picture? Type what you heard, add a timestamp and continue. Either review what you just typed or listen to the next segment. Well, it's interesting um, that you ask. Type what you heard, add a timestamp, and repeat these steps. It is easy to check selected sections in your transcript. Just double click on one of the entries in the list of timestamps. Uh, um, in the sense, I mean, just kind of um, turning, a, twisting a bit the, the name. If you notice an error, you can edit the transcript, then check if everything is correct now. Uh, um, in the sense, I mean, just kind of um, turning, a, twisting a bit the, the name Atlas uh, TI. To sum up, here you see the main components of transcribing your data with Atlas TI.